Greetings dear viewers, I am Building Block, and today we will be taking a look at LEGO City set number 60137 Tow Truck Trouble. So here we have what looks like a police chase scene with a tow truck dragging a big bolt being pursued by two officers on bikes. First we'll take a look at the police officers on their cycles. They do look nice, especially with the gold with, for the rims. Now this bike looks like something you'd see patrolling the streets. It even has a couple of clips to hold some accessories a walkie-talkie, and what I assume is a flashing sign. There's also a pair of handcuffs, but the instructions don't say where to store them. Another nitpick though that I just noticed is that the windshield seems to have been painted a bit crookedly. But ah well, not a serious issue. It's hardly noticeable actually. Besides, I may not have been so good with the stickers myself. I may be off just a couple of degrees. Now this bike is a bit of a stretch. It looks more like a dirt bike than something for the streets. Granted, I don't know much about the police vehicles or equipments, so I could be wrong. There are two kickstands on the sides that rotate. No clips to hold accessories, however. Bit of a bummer. The officers look nice, both in standard issue uniforms. There even looks like some reflective paint on them, like the badges, and both wearing confident smiles. Next we have the main focus of the set, the speeding truck fleeing with the goods. Looks very cool for a simple build. The crane arm is articulated with ratchet joints and a bull joint at the hook, though the hook isn't loose, so it doesn't move around freely. Over the sides we have some clips to carry the crook's tools, a wrench, and a crowbar, and what looks like a blowtorch just pegged in next to the door. Then there's the roof that can pop off easily. Now one nitpick I have with this truck is the placement of the sticker. That's actually a very poor spot there. A company's logo should always be on the sides, the hood, or at least on a sign on top, not just left on the roof. No one can see that there if it were life size. And here we have the crook, a regular lean, mean, tough guy with a scowl. Though one thing I noticed that must be a trend with almost every LEGO City police sets, the crooks are still wearing their prison uniforms. Kind of a dead giveaway. Though this guy had the brains to cover it up with a vest, making him pass as a tow truck driver. Barely. Said vest also has some reflective paint. Going back to the cuffs, you can actually use them to arrest the crook. Nice touch! Last, but certainly not least, is the vault. Looks simple and has an old timey feel with the logo. Now if you open up the safe, you'll find a red diamond on top of a small safe. Inside that safe are three cash tiles. Each tile can be slotted in through the hole in the safe. This vault can be attached to the hook, like so. Overall, I think the design and build is rather neat. Pretty cool, actually. I especially like the idea of the crook just taking the vault in a quick getaway fashion, rather than just taking time to open it up in the bank. Pretty clever. A bit messy, but clever. Pretty small set, but still enjoyable. You can get this set at the LEGO Store website, link in the description. That's all the time I have for now, but I'll catch you guys next time. Take care!